I'm here with Calvin Felker. Felker. We're at Felker Motorsports today, and uh, we're converting uh, this Razor XP over from uh, pump fuel to E85. Remember, there's a gas station right next to them that's got a, a pump there with the E85, so it's going to be an awesome project for them. It's going to allow them to run more boost and uh, save money doing it. So, I pulled the fuel injectors out that were set up for pump gas, which they were already replaced from stock anyway, uh, being larger. The ones we're going to put in for E85 are even larger yet. We have to do that because of the excess fuel that we need to run. To run E85, you typically burn about 30% more fuel on E85 than you would on uh, pump fuel. So uh, I had the stock injectors out already, like I said. Had the new larger injectors. Just going to place them in the port on the engine. Then we'll put the fuel rail back on. E85 was kind of the perfect fit for my sister who this kit's for. Um, we have a gas station right next door that has E85. And you know, you can run higher boost levels like race fuel, but it's a lot cheaper. And it's a four seater, she likes to take all our friends, so it just makes sense, you know, save her a lot of money. So now we got the fuel injectors installed, the new larger injectors. Uh, we're gonna hook up the Aero Commander back up to it. And it just like it did before, the connectors go on the injectors. Then they'll plug into the factory wiring harness. Here in the Walden Sand Dunes in northern Colorado. Uh, we're trying out our E85 Razor XP and driving our uh, a couple runs here, some shoots in the trees, teaching me how to read the boost gauge, the AFR gauge, checking out what the RPM is, letting me know what I should be running at. Pretty cool that the Aero Charger guys came out. Andrew's one of the engineers and he got her all fixed up today, got our E85 kit on and now we're spending the evening at the dunes. Thing runs like a dream so far, I can't wait to get the music bumping and my girls in here. In the dunes. <laughs> thing is awesome. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be going brooch in my head all night long. Eight pounds of boost on E85 right now. Uh, you know, it turns 8,100 RPM on some 28 inch paddles. We've got a ton of paddle on here, so it's definitely making power. Blast the cameraman. Air fuels are looking really good under power. different loads, different levels of boost, making sure it's working in all conditions.
Hey guys, we're here today in uh, beautiful North Park, Colorado. There's some dunes here. Um, we're with Brooke Felker. She, uh, she is one of the Felkers from Felker Motorsports in Loveland, Colorado. Uh, they're a big dealer for us. I believe you guys have done 60 some odd kits with the snowmobiles. But you have a summer toy. Tell yeah. us what you've got here. I got a 2013 Razor four seater 900. Wow. Yeah. And, and, and you've got a few accessories. Yeah. What all you got on here? Well, I got the Pro Armor seats, five point harnesses, system with the sub. I got my new paddles. <laughs> I guess that's it. Oh, the doors that you guys helped me put on today. And? <laughs> and E85 Aero Charger Turbo. Brooks dealership sits right next to a gas station that has E85. And E85 is a Basically, it's a cheap race fuel. Um, it's subsidized by the government, which is great for race fuel. You paid $2.40 or $2.30 a gallon for it. Now, you will consume about 30% more, but compared to race fuel, it's, it's way cheaper. So, you know, you use 30% more, but it's about there the price. What do you think? I love it. <laughs> I can't wait to get it loaded up with girls and crank up the system, system and go. I think it's going to work great for me for this summer. And you, you do that a lot. You have a pack of girls that go out and ride ATVs all by yourself with no guys. Yep. A little, little unusual and a little, can I say kick ass? Because it is. <laughs> yeah, but you girls time. are going to have fun. The four seater is wonderful. Um, and you're a Skidoo dealer, which you would think maybe you'd go the Can-Am route but you wanted a four-seater for the girls, and the XP four-seater is a wonderful platform. I'm pumped, I can't wait, I can't wait to go. I'm thankful for you guys for coming out and finishing it up, brought everybody out, and really did the full nine yards for me, so I appreciate it. Thanks.